Beyoncé's publicist and team are going hard to defend the singer after she faced more accusations of stealing from the Erica Badu. Badu has accused Beyoncé of stealing her looks over the past few months, starting with an oversized top hat Yance wore on stage similar to the one the 53-year-old frequently wears. The neo-soul singer also made fun of her silver look during Bay's Renaissance tour last year. Hmm, she added in the caption, I guess I'm everybody's stylist. Now, she has accused the fellow Texan of copying her style for her highly anticipated, Cowboy Carter album. Beyoncé released a picture from her new album cover featuring her wearing Fulani braids with beads, and Badu seemingly threw shade by sharing the picture in her Instagram stories with the caption hum. After the Tyrone singer was dragged by the beehive for being shady, she called on Bay's husband of almost 17 years to speak up. To Jay-Z. Say something Jay, wrote Badu. You gone let this woman and these bees do this to me laughing emoji. The post also included a video of a man crying from an recent episode of The Caramo Show, as he says, I might hate you for the rest of my life for real. Because you knew. You knew. To Jay-Z. Say something Jay. You gone let this woman and these bees do this to me smiling face with open mouth and tightly closed eyes pic.twitter.com Akungfup. Erica Badula at Fat Bella Bella March 20, 2024. Badu's request that Jay-Z step in was seemingly the last straw for her publicist, Noel Schur, who posted a montage of Beyoncé on Instagram rocking Fulani braids throughout her lengthy career. The post was captioned, She slays. She slays. Now. Then. Always. Act 2 Cowboy Carter 3.29 Critics Without Credentials Making the drama even more thick, Justina Omakwa, the senior vice president of Beyoncé's entertainment company Parkwood Entertainment shared a post of of the singer's album along with lyrics from Badu's song Tyrone. But Cha don't know how to act, so matter fact. Parkwood Entertainment SVP Justina Omakwa posted Erica Badu Tyrone lyrics on her IG story face with tears of joy pic.twitter.com 1LHS and 3 ho 5V. Cowboy Carter updates at B8 album CC March 21, 2024. Badu has been known to wear Fulani braids herself. But despite the drama between the two legendary artists, neither woman is responsible for inventing Fulani braids or the trend of women who wear them. The look originated by women in the West African and the Sahel regions of Africa by the Fulani people centuries ago, and the hair is often decorated with beads, shells, wooden, or metal accents and sometimes silver coins and amber from a family for heritage purposes. Other celebrities have rocked Fulani braids bedside Spadu and Bay, including actress Gabrielle Union. Kim Kardashian has also appropriated the look and was dragged after she incorrectly attributed the look to actress Bo Derek from the 1979 film 10. Hey, it's just a hairstyle that I wore in the movie 10 at Kim Kardashian calls it the Bo Derek because she copied my pattern of braids. I copied it from Anne Margaret S. Backup Singer from her Vegas show. And we all copied Queen Nofridery. I hope Her Royal Highness is flattered. PIC.twitter.com UUQKH8VKOI. Bo Derek at Bo Derek January 31, 2018. Jay Z has yet to respond to Badu's request, and she has not yet responded to the latest declaration by Bay's publicist. But Bay's album, Cowboy Carter, drops March 29th.